yeah dear students in the second episode now let me demonstrate to you a concept a very important concept with rotating bodies called moment of inertia all of us are very familiar with what is inertia inertia is basically inherent property of the body by virtue of which the body continues to remain in the existing state it can be the state of rest it can be the state of motion it can be the state of direction the same is what we now go to observe in the case of a rotating body a rotating body does keep on rotating unless until some external force or torque is acted upon it so the inability of the rotating body to come to rest by itself is called rotational inertia or moment of inertia basically moment of inertia depends on the mass of the body the distribution of mass and the distance of the body from the axis of rotation on the mass of the body is what we are trying to take now to prove experimentally that moment of inertia of heavier bodies will be more and lighter bodies will be less i now here have with me three identical bodies one made of plastic lighter mass other made of aluminum little greater mass and the third of the same size made of iron with larger mass let me now rotate all the three spheres at the same instant i go to observe that the moment of inertia of iron circular wheel is more than aluminium than plastic how do i infer that it is from the observation what i go to do in the experiment i do observe that the plastic frame comes to rest sooner then next comes to rest is aluminium and finally iron rim will continue to keep on rotating and then after a greater interval it comes to rest because of greater inertia right so heavier the body greater will be the inertia lighter the body lesser will be the inertia is what theoretically we can count down for moment of inertia right now look here i am rotating plastic aluminium iron see that plastic has come to rest following plastic is aluminium and you now see that iron wheel is keeping on rotating 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 right that is because of its greater mass the moment of inertia of the iron rim is more so it will keep on rotating 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 and then finally does come to rest is that clear to everyone my dear boys how moment of inertia does depend on mass of the body yes or no yes sir right now one of you please go for the practical observation of that one of you please do the same you observed yes sir what did you observe plastic and aluminum is going to stop plastic has come to rest yes, sir. aluminum is about to come to rest yes, but you do see that the iron wheel is still rotating due to greater moment of inertia so this is how using this simple experiment i go to confirm that heavier bodies have greater moment of inertia and lighter bodies have less moment of inertia so this is how we are using experiment trying to clarify this dependence of moment of inertia on mass of the body is that clear my dear boys yes, right thank you very much